All right, hello and welcome. It's going to be Nessie in the Battle Alliance Arena. This is possibly going to be talking about the break mission slash troop mission combinations that may be arising in SC Gundam Battle Alliance. Now, this is from the opening cinematic once again, but again, there was gameplay revealed as well. I'm going to link it down below, again, from New Type Seiji. So um, the only one we know confirmed 100% is, of course, the first mission, which was Rambo Rawl attacking the white base when it was, you know, recovering from Garma and Armora was basically away and, you know, had a temper tantrum. So... The true mission is, of course, that same mission where Amuro comes back and, you know, he faced off against Rambaral and, you know, the whole touching situation where Rambaral forgot to fight, that type of deal. And the break mission is that very same thing, but Amuro's nowhere to be seen. And instead of Rambaral attacking, it's the Gundam Barbado 6th form. And Mikazuki's just like, I'm going to kill everybody that just gets in the way of me and Orga. It's cool. I like it. It's a very intriguing concept. Again, um, I did akin it to SC Gundam G Generation Overworlds when they did have the break and or the, you know, true missions per se, but they weren't called true missions. They were just like, you know, the actual things and the break missions were just going above and beyond the generation break. So I don't know if that's going to be possible. Maybe there is going to be multiple break missions. We don't know. But so far, there's only one confirmed for each stage. So the first one is, of course, it showed Gundam, Zeta, Double Zeta, Shars Counterattack. So there may be a combination between those two that maybe have true and or, um, what is it, break missions, per se. One series might go into another. Let's say the Double Zeta replaces the... Sharzaku or something, or you know, Alpha Zeru replaces the Zeon. Uh, number two was Wing Gundam and Gundam Unicorn. Again, this one's probably pretty cut and dry. The true mission's probably going to be the you know, Epion versus the Wing, and the break mission is probably going to be the Neo Zeon against the Gundam Unicorn Green. Third one was shown was Double O G Reco, which hasn't had any representative shown yet, except again for the G self, which was shown in the opening cinematic. And of course, the turn A was face off against the turn X. Now, again, these are both space related series, so I'd assume maybe they'll shift over. Maybe the Reborn's Gundam will be facing Loran, and then of course, the Double Arise will probably go up against the turn X. Um, I'm excited to hear Takeda Koyatsu again because he's one of my favorite voice actors. Yay. Um, then, of course, uh, the fourth one was G Gundam and Destiny. Again, it showed the Destroy Gundams and the Master Gundam, and of course, the God Gundam and the Destiny Gundam. Now, again, the last one was Gundam Seed, Destiny, and Seed. And, of course, Turn or V Gundam and Gundam X. The reason why it showed it is because, again, sort of a space theme, Gundam X, uh, the DX has to use the Moon Satellite Cannon, and they just wanted to make it look cinematic with, of course, the Satellite Cannon, uh, the Strike Freedom shooting all of its beams, and of course the V2 Assault Buster shooting its big, huge beam uh, straight ahead. So, again, I don't know what the combinations are going to be for each. What are your dream combinations for uh, Break and our true missions? Leave your comments down below. I do heart. I do uh, reply as well. Uh, like the video, and of course, subscribe. Uh, goal is 30. Again, if you uh, watch the video, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.